Good morning. It's a bright but chilly start for many of us. However, that won't last too long as a band of rain is on the way. However, having said that, across eastern areas, particularly through the southeast, I think you'll see the best of the brightness lasting until around lunchtime. But from the west, as I said, it is going to deteriorate. So Northern Ireland seeing the rain at first. That's going to spread across much of the country by this afternoon. But it will turn particularly heavy across parts of northwest England, the Lake District, for example. But also it's western Scotland where we have this rain warning in force. So Dumfries and Galloway, Argyll and Butte seeing the heaviest rain up to around 60 millimetres is possible. Further south, across the southwest, there will be quite a brisk southwesterly wind, quite a lot of cloud around and drizzly outbreaks of rain will come and go through this afternoon. But the further east you are, the more likely you are to see a bit of shelter from that rain. But it's definitely going to turn a lot cloudier than this morning by the end of the day. It is going to be significantly milder though by the end of the day. This southwesterly breeze is bringing with it significantly warmer air than this morning. So temperatures will rise to the mid-teens this afternoon and it's going to stay mild throughout tonight and to the, through the rest of the week. So it could be quite a muggy night. This band of rain that will have lingered across Scotland will sink southwards throughout this evening as well. It will tend to fade away as it does sink southwards, but it'll likely be a fairly cloudy and potentially quite drizzly start across the south coast on Friday. Elsewhere, there will be some cloud and rain around, particularly over coast, across coastal areas and over the hills in the northwest. But it's going to be a quite a lot drier to start the day on Thursday compared to much of today. And as I said, it is going to be very mild tonight. These are the minimum temperatures for this evening. These are much closer to the daytime average maximum temperatures for this time of year. Could feel fairly close as well overnight. So it's going to be a very different feel tomorrow morning compared to this morning. And on Thursday, there will be more in the way of drier and brighter weather finally. The best of the brightness will likely be across eastern coast eastern areas of Scotland and north coast as well, as well as parts of Lincolnshire spreading down to parts of Norfolk will likely see the best of the brighter weather. And in that sunshine, it will feel fairly warm. Highs of 17, 18, possibly 19 degrees. However, further southwest, you're likely to see some of this rain arriving by the end of the day. There is some uncertainty with quite how far north this rain will spread through Thursday, but it could push into parts of Northern Ireland, but it's going to be staying fairly mild. That's because this area of rain is a warm front, and that warm front will push further north into parts of Northern Ireland and Scotland for Friday. So it will be another fairly wet day, particularly for the northwest on Friday, with higher pressure becoming a bit more dominant across Across southern areas that brings hope of a bit more of a, the way in the way of prolonged dry weather for southern areas make sure you keep up to date with all of our forecasts on YouTube and don't forget to subscribe bye bye